Hi guys, today we're going to be doing a Q&A video. I put out a post on Facebook on the 25th of November asking for Q&As. Can't talk today. <laughs> asking for questions for a Q&A video. I got, hang on, let me just check on this fabulous laptop that I got for Christmas. Um. Well, I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight questions to do in this video, and it should be going up today, which is the 21st of January 2017. So, actually, put this on like two months ago, and I'm only just filming it. Ha! So. Let's just get started. Right, so, first question is by Tyler Faulkner. I'll leave a description to his channel. I'll leave a link to his channel in the description below. Hey put, am I a good mate? The answer to that, Tyler, is... I need some thinking time. Yeah, yeah, you are. Yes. And, okay, on to question two, which is from Andy Berry. Are you a Clem? He put. Um, yeah, I guess so. Seeing as uh, that's what I always get called by you and Dad. So, yeah, I am a Clem. And on to question three. Um... Which is by Sonny Langstaff. My dad. I've got no friends. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, the question he asked was, to what extent do you shape your own destiny and how much is down to fate? Because that is such an easy question to understand. What does that even mean? Hang on. Time to use Google for a second. Google is always the answer to everything. Right, basically, this question is about personal belief in determinism. Some people believe that they can shape their destiny because it's their subjective experience. Some people believe that everything is 100% predefined because the world can be described by physics. Also, there are a lot of opinions in between. Some people even claim that free will, ability to change flow, ability to change flow of events, has no rel relation to determinism. Right, so I think basically it's asking me, like, how much do I control my future and how much does it just, how much is it just down to fate, so how much does it just, just, just let it go, you know, I, I don't know. What does it, does it mean that, does it, I don't know, I don't know, I'm just going to answer what I thought it means. Um, in my opinion, everything that happens in the future is down to your own doings. So everything that happens is consequently you're doing. And yeah, fate happens because people are people. And what is happening with these blinds? There we go. Yeah, so yeah, that's my answer to number question three. Question number three, is it? Yeah, question number three. Question number four is by Jodie Lee, my auntie, because I've got no friends. <laughs> Ahem. Right, what was the worst lie you have ever told? Um. Hmm. Don't know the answer to that, to be honest, Jodie. I actually have no clue. No clue whatsoever the answer to that because I feel like I've paper cut myself there, but I haven't. It's just itchy and stingy. So yeah, my answer to that question is I don't know. Don't judge. <laughs> question five is by Jack Taylor, my friend this time. Yeah, I've got a friend. Woo! <clears throat> What's your worst fear? 
Hmm. I believe that my worst fear is drowning. Because I can't swim. I've never liked water. Well, I kind of do now. Well, I, 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 I like to try and swim. But, you know. But when I was little, I never liked water at all. So, yeah. Um, so, yeah, my worst fear is drowning. So, yeah. Question. Three, four, five. Question six. Six. Question six. Um, would you be poor with friends or be rich with no friends? Hmm. Hmm. Be poor with friends because money can't buy you happiness. Well, it can buy you drugs, which makes you happy. But you know what I mean. Money can't buy you happiness, real happiness. So, but if you're friends, they can make you happy and then therefore you will be happy. So, yeah. Yay, friends! Um, question number seven. I can't do it like that. I end up pulling the wrong fingers up. <laughs> um, would you let your best friend die or you die? Hmm. Depends in what scenario it is. If my best friend was drowning and I tried going in to save them, we'd both drown. So, you know, but basically that's me trying to make, help make them live and me die, in it. But, I say if it's like someone was going to just shoot them, like go, I'd try and jump in front of them to take the bullet for them. Because I'm a nice person like that. I think. I hope. I wish. <laughs> anyway, question number eight. I did it! I did it! Woohoo! Question number eight. Um, which is the last question, believe it or not. The last question I just said at the beginning, there's only going to be eight questions. And this video is like eight minutes long anyway, so it's going to be like ages. Well, I don't know if it's eight minutes long after me editing it, but you know. Who knows? Until I've edited it. 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 Finally got it. Um, this is by Jack. Oh, the past four questions by Jack Taylor, including this. What do you like most about me? Don't know. You ginger. <laughs> I'm joking. Um, you're funny. You're a midget. You make me feel taller than I already do. Um, <laughs> uh, so yeah, just funny. And yeah, that's basically it, really. I'm joking. You're a good friend. You're there for me. You're funny. And all that, you know. Everything a friend should be, you know. Holy moly! So, thank you for watching this video. If you watched it and you enjoyed it, please give it a like. Please subscribe. And do not forget to turn on the notifications because whenever I upload a video my eyes just gone blank what am I gonna say what do I say my eyes go blank I can't think um that's it whenever I upload a video on your phone laptop computer tablet whatever you're watching it on apart from consoles I think whatever you're watching it on it'll go J Lango videos uploaded a new video and then it will say in inverted commas the title and you probably already know that but you know it's just me being a weirdo yet again so yeah just do what I say like comment good things good things please friends and subscribe turn on notifications and I will see you in the next video peace